This is Jim Houston, and I'm Bill Clement. Sure happy you're aboard for more NHL action, folks. The best teams compete game in and game out over the course of the season. And you know what happens if you don't? You find yourself watching the playoffs instead of playing in them. The Florida Panthers win the faceoff. The net is off its mooring. Florida puts its second line up. Ottawa won the draw. He gets a hold of it. That stop. Tugna moves the puck to Salo. Tugna gets the puck to Laukinen. Salo passes ahead to Dackel. He takes the puck. Tugna kicks it aside. Crossbow takes the puck. Dackel took the shot from the right. Bob stops it. He shoots! Tugna kept it out. Gives it to Salo. He is checked. He didn't just hit him, he crushed him. Lines up, backhand shot from the right. Tugna stopped it. Florida gobbles it up. Save! Across to Gardner. Great hit! The penalty will be called as soon as the Senators turn it over. Penalty against the Panthers for spearing. You want more? Go away. Get through here. Ottawa puts its number one power play unit out. Florida penalty to number ten. Picked up by Arvidsson. Major for spearing and the game. He is collects coming. the puck. With the puck, Arvidsson passes it across. He takes the puck. He stopped. He one times it from the right. Kravchuk gets hit. A dirty hit like that, and you immediately become the guy with the bullseye on his back. Kravchuk gets hit. He winds up, shoots! That stop. He gets the puck. Dackel moves it on. It's one on one. Bob stopped it. Good save. He shoots! That stop. He gets a hold of it. Shoots! He's checked. He takes the puck. He one times it from the left. Saved by Tugnut. It's one on one. Arvidsson, Bob, kicked it aside. McEachran moves it ahead. Crossbow shoots. Florida gets to the puck first and beats out the icing call. It's one on one. He collects the puck. Intercepted. Great save. Laukinen picks it up. It's one on one. That stop. He gets the puck. It's off the post. Deflection. He scores. Let's take another look at this play. Here's a good example of why a player who doesn't mind standing in between the shooter and the goalie can score a lot of goals. Just tough finding volunteers. Florida goal scored by number seven. Shoots from the right. Kicked aside. 
He gets the puck. He shoots! Ottawa gobbles it up. Kravchuk gets hit. A delayed call against Florida. He's going to get called for high sticking. Let's take another look at that penalty. He knows here that he's committed an infraction, but he's probably hoping he could get away with just a simple apology. I don't think so, not this time. Florida penalty, That's 227. Two minutes for high sticking. Last minute of play. McKinnon leans into a shot from the right. Only 30 seconds remaining in the period. He has it. After one period, Florida leads by one. Hi, everybody, and welcome back for the second period. Interception. Deckel fires a shot from the point. Bob stops him. Oh, he just slams the door on the rebound. Nice save. He scores! Let's take another look at that goal. Backhanders tend not to be particularly hard shots, but sometimes it's difficult for the goalies to get a read on it. With that goal, Florida now leads by a score of 2 to nothing. The next goal could make or break this game for them. A three-goal lead gives you a couple of free mistakes. A one-goal lead is precarious at the best of times. Tugna made the blocker save. Florida goal. That stops Arvidsson. Passes it across. By number he has it. Alfredson gets him. Ottawa 16. with the puck. And by number 52. Redden picks it up. The penalty will be called as soon as the Panthers touch the puck. Yashin moves it ahead. Extra attacker out with the delayed penalty. He's going to the box for that high stick. Let's take another look at that penalty. Sometimes you just have to play your game and hope the ref doesn't notice. But you also need to be a little less conspicuous about it. Crossbull draws the puck back. Florida penalty to number 15. Two minutes for... He five. collects the puck. Intercepted. He gets the puck. Tugna made the save. McEachern moves it ahead. Ottawa takes over. Alfredson intercepts the pass. To Alfredson, kick the side. Puck is loose. Crossbull jumps to it. Salo gets it. Who wants it? Florida gets possession. The shot from the left. That stopped. Puck is loose. Who fired it from the slot? Tugna kept it out. He plays the puck to Sallo. It's one on one. Puck is loose. Puck is loose. He gets the puck. Ah, stopped him. It's one on one. That stopped. Salo passes across. He has it. Winds up. Shoots. That stop. Salo gets checked. He gets the puck. Ottawa gets the puck. It's one on one. McEachern snapped the shot from the right. Great save. Takes the shot. He scores. Here's the replay of that goal. Backhanders tend not to be particularly hard shots, but sometimes it's difficult for the goalie to get a read on it. Yashin won the draw. He gets the puck. Great hit! The penalty will be called as soon as the Panthers turn it over. Penalty called for high sticking. Let's take a look at the replay. You know, you shouldn't get your stick up like that on other players. It's just plain dangerous. 
Once Alexi Yashin established himself in the NHL, he clearly established himself at the top of the Ottawa Senators' scoring race. Sure did, Jim. During the 97-98 season, he led the Sens with 33 goals and 39 assists for 72 points. You know what else? That was the fourth time in four years that he led his team in scoring. Ottawa penalty. He collects the puck. Alexi Yashin. He fakes out possible. He takes the puck. He gets the puck. The penalty will be called as soon as the Senators turn it over. Penalty called for hooking. Can we get a replay of that penalty? Well, Jim, you break the rules, you go to the box. So says the man wearing the stripes. The ref gets ready to drop the puck. The Panthers win the faceoff. Florida penalty to number That's 11. Stopped. Two minutes for He one-times it from the left. That's stopped. McEachran Fans passes to his own blue line. Yashin steps back on the game. ice, and his team will enjoy a shortened power play here. Ottawa puts its number one power play today. unit out. Deckle scores on the power play. Their power play is just like a bill collector. It makes you pay. Let's take another look at that goal. Check this out. He takes the pass and gets off a shot from the right side. The goalie gets the pad stack, but it finds its way into the back of the net regardless. Nice work. Ottawa goal. Score Alfredson gets it. Yes, made the shot. Hey, you just shot the puck in your own net. Magnus Alfredson hands by number 29. Yes, currently ranked first on the team in assists. Assisted by number 11, Shoots. Daniel Tugman grabs it with a big trapper. Dackel passes it across to Prospol. The goalie leaves the net on the delayed penalty call. Florida gets called for high sticking. Let's take another look at that penalty. You know, you shouldn't get your stick up like that on other players. It's just plain dangerous. Florida penalty to number Save. 16. Two minutes for He goes sticking. to it. Kravchuk intercepted it. Takes the shot. That stop. Fearlessly blocked by the Florida the Panthers. Period. He collects the puck. After 40 minutes, Florida is ahead, three to two. Welcome back, folks. This game is about to get underway again. He shoots. That stop. Redden moves it ahead. Bob gets it. His pass intercepted by Redden. Bob with the puck. He has it. He deeks Redden. Tugman, stop that. Gives it to Yashin. That stop. Kravchuk gobbles it up. He's checked. He takes the puck. Deep to Yashin. Yeah! He's checked. Gets picked up by the Ottawa Senators. That stop. Dackel gobbles it up. Parkinson, Bob, saves it. Quickly on it. That stop. Tugnut moves the puck to Kravchuk. Dackel moves it on. It's one on one. It was stopped by Bob. Rifles a shot. That stop. He collects the puck. He's checked. The penalty will be called as soon as the Senators turn it over. Penalty called for high sticking. Can we get a replay of that penalty? Here's the play that resulted in that last penalty being handed out. The Florida Panthers win the faceoff. He's stopped. Florida penalty to number nine. Tugna moves the puck to Crossbow. He has it. 
It's one on one. Tegna makes the save. He collects the puck. McEachern gets the puck to Prospel. Prospel has a clear path to the net. Save. He collects the puck. He dekes out Sallow. him McEachern is back in uniform for the first time since the injury the injury time had to be tough for him you know he's not the kind of guy who likes to watch his team play from the press box John McEachern is a product of Boston University known for his speed one timer Tugna saves he swings one off the post Redden ahead to Alfredson Bob made the save. He takes around Redden. He wings one off the post. He fakes out Arvidsson. He gets the puck. Three hit. Scores his third of the game to earn the hat trick. Nice. Let's take another look at this play. Watch this. He takes the puck and takes a wrist shot from the right side. The goalie tries to get his blocker on it, but it beats him anyway. Nice work. With that goal, Florida now leads by a score of 4-2. to two. If they blow this lead, I sure wouldn't want to be at their next practice. That stop. Florida goal, his third of the game. Scoring timer, Tugna made the Assisted blocker save. Number 17. It's one-on-one. -on -one. What a save. Ottawa goes to it. Dackel scores. Here's the replay of that goal. Check this out. Dackel takes the puck and gets off a shot from the right side. The goalie gets the pad stack, but it finds its way into the back of the net regardless. Pretty goal. Dackel, as of the start of this game, was ranked third on the team in goals. Kicked aside by Bob. Ottawa goal, scored by number 10, Andreas Dackel, assisted by number he 15, picks it up. Sean McCutcheon. Crabjack collects, he scores! Well, with no attending like that, you might want to consider just going with the extra attack. Timeout is being called. Well, this time out will give both teams a chance to put out their best lines. With that goal, Florida now leads by a score of 5-3. to three. With so little time left on the clock, that two-goal lead might as well be 20. Florida goal. Here's Picked up by the Ottawa the Senators. Scores by number he nine. takes the puck. The goal Shot! He stops it into the empty net. Let's take another look at how the puck ended up in the net. It's always beautiful to have a yawning cage to shoot the puck at. Florida makes a line change. With that goal, Florida now leads by a score Florida of 6-3. That goal was just a little icing on the cake, or a little salt in the wound, depending on...